Welcome back to Let's Play Hot Wheels Extreme Racing. I think we actually have the same lineup in this tournament as we had last time. I still don't know why we never... Whoa. There we go. <laughs> That's what I was looking for. So we ought to get a bunch of points, which largely means attacking everyone. I can catch up with everyone fairly easily right now. Handling is unfortunately not the best on the other hand. Super heavy car. I can live with it, I think. I really would like to actually see the other cars are unlocked back. The cars I unlock in these tournaments. I don't know why they always have the same group of racers. I think they have different cars as time goes on. Come on, guys. Where are you? There. Stop being there. I don't think that does splash damage, unfortunately. damage of this. If I can, I'll be really nice. Fortunately, it's a little tough rubbing up against anyone when I have. Okay. It's a little tough rubbing up against anyone when I'm just difficult to control. Not sure if I chose the right balance stats or not. It is really important and very helpful. To catch up to everyone, but if I can't really aim myself well or anything, it's another problem. Okay, never mind, there we go. That one wasn't even aimed. Okay, so I might. I don't know if I'll settle or not for what I have now in favor of. Trying to get first in the race. See, so I can really blow ahead of everyone if I want to. That's really a place for mine. on can. Will is another matter. 40,000 is satisfying though. I'll take that. Take it first. Yep. Good job, Metacog. Destructive as always. And the other robot finishes second too. So here's the question. Do the robots know where Gearhead is? Are they also looking for Gearhead? I don't know. Are they leading anyone, everyone to a particular place? Potentially to find your head? Or are they just trying to stop them or distract them instead? It will be nice when we get that next gear though. I hope we don't get that gear last, because that would be kind of dumb. The fifth gear. We have only three, three right now too, so we have two more to get. But whenever the fifth gear comes, I hope it's not like a 100% reward, because then we'd have no use for it. You know, I don't really don't think I need that much weight. That was too much weight last time. It's hard to decide what stats to give yourself, because it is extremely helpful to be able to pass anyone on a straightaway, but at the same time... Much of anything. Oh jeez, I, I didn't think I'd hold on to it the way I did. I don't want that. Let's go. Or you, Junior Rat Storm, but you took it anyways. Oh, fire everywhere. There's that, which did precisely nothing. Ow. 
Apparently that's what I managed to really pick that up. I haven't seen this in a while. Some of though it managed to blow up the nearby box when all the cars exploded. Come on guys. Come on. There you go. Yeah, this is pretty satisfactory score already. Get more points for being more accurate that or anything. Eh, there you go. <laughs> Managed to try something to look for. Oh, eventually, that thing hit me. Eh, got me a little bit. I say, I don't know. I didn't really make our decision. I'm missing by so much of those, but I don't think that very well though. Ow. Yeah, see, I can see that he has, that Silhouette has a weapon now, because I can see that their little cannon has, has its lights on, which is cool. Zoom! It's weird how you can delay the turbo. Ah, uh -huh. uh, yeah. This actually might be my record for number of points in one race if I can get first. I could just take first now, of course. That's nice. 67,000. Take that, Danny. It's nice race coming second. It's quite satisfying. Don't know what he was using that power up for, but. Oh well. What the destruction. You know, I never actually noticed that particular level had a volcano in the background. I was always too focused on the action. It's crazy that this game actually subverts norms enough to not point out that there's a volcano in a level with a volcano. Also, I already have enough points to win. And this one, I'm actually content to just finish the races. Uh, at the same time, I should take this seriously because it's practice for the others. Alright, I'll do my usual setup then. I'll just go for points. I haven't noticed any pattern, maybe I should have, of which things unlock what. Like if the gold medals always unlock cars or something like that. I don't know if that's the case or not. What well, could possibly always be the case of things are right now. That was way early. I could sometimes be the case. You basically like hit an invisible wall in the air there. I expect to be able to jump over it, but it doesn't let me for some reason. There we go. And gem. Thank you. No skull. Skulls on this camera. Still super cruel. How much damage they do to you? If they did less damage, I guess I wouldn't mind them as much. I know it still goes forward, start it. Try to subvert the system. Satisfying seeing this car as an actual jet. That didn't go the way I was hoping. Sliding everywhere. Whoa. That wasn't really what I needed. Yeah, 
Not that it's a problem that I got slowed down a little bit, I guess, because I still need to be next to everyone to actually attack them. It does bug me that you don't get any bonus, as far as I can tell, for destroying your opponents. Ow! Still not all the points here at all. What have you done? There we go. Nobody ever got the power up there, it seems like. Unless the power up's always a turbo, which I doubt. we had in getting cursed. <laughs> Good camera. Now then, what did we tell you race game about facing through solid objects? It's a fairly vatish thing to do. I don't know if I should be concerned about that or not. Okay. And yeah, we have time this episode. And it's just... Oh wait, no, no, no. Um, plane we don't need. And let's go with that, I guess. Oh wait, no, this isn't what I thought it was. Never mind. I'll upgrade all these then. It's the second difficulty, I think. It's super heavy, bug. And it has the course where you can be either plane or a boat at one point. And if and I never take the jet portion, so there's no reason for you to upgrade the jet on that one. But the way it's described in the percentages makes you think that you actually want to have all three. Okay. I should really want that speed boost. Well, I got the power up first, so nice. It is always nice getting first steps on the power ups. Oh! Explosions messed me up. Explosions messed me up. Ah, explosions messed me both of us up. I did not use that turbo the way I meant to. Oh, kind of a dodge. Did I get points on him? Just but he probably didn't take damage from that, but I seem to get points from hitting him. It's kind of weird. So here I will actually depart from everyone else for a moment and get this. Roadblock? No roadblock. Darn it. That does seem to be a, kind of a blue shell there. The weird yellow rocket thing. That gives you way too many points. I still insist. Don't like this bump here. It's really awkward. It's one of those little things that makes it feel like these ships or these levels weren't really made to be played in reverse. Attack. The range on this thing is not what it needs to be. Why aren't bullets so short range? Oh. Can't figure that out. See race cam again after that. Just kind of disappeared in the explosion. Ow. Alright. No, no flame. 
You guys, for some reason, don't take the shortcut, so I'll take that myself. It's a nice way to... Ah, I do such a moment earlier. It's a nice way to secure your victory, though. At the end there. I think I'm okay with 30,000. I'm trying to turn around, I'm just trying to cut the corner to hit that skull. Catch me now. Actually, not too far behind me. Oh darn. It's not gonna help. Alright, we're good though. Eh. Capsize the ship. Anyways. So, wait, which was that actually the last race? Yeah, it was. Cool. So, we have to end this episode with a lot more stuff, whatever it is, even if it's just a letter. I do feel like that's a little bit of a fake out reward, just getting letters for this code, especially with how obvious it is what the code is from the very beginning. Oh well. Here's my Metacog. You broke stuff. Now what kind of score do we get here? So I think this is my highest record. It might be. C. Oh. Oh, look at that. That's not what I thought it would be. Finally. The plot actually thickens. And no, I did not actually manage to break my record on there. Darn it. Actually, it's about where my record is for everything. Weird. Anyways, that'll be it for this episode. Let's play how it was extreme racing. We would start about cup six. Huh. Although I wasn't picking up gems or anything. And I wasn't trying to attack anyone, so that's why I didn't get many points. Regardless, I'll see you guys next time in the next episode. Let's play Hot Wheels Extreme Racing. We're going to go to medium. As who will see? I don't know. It's tempting to just be Shadow Jet right now. We'll see. Anyways, bye everyone.